Hey, what is going on guys? This is Claudia and today I want to talk about the Supreme San Francisco box logo dropping online. So let's get right into the video. Now before I give you my whole breakdown and opinions on it, I would, I would like to ask you guys, do you guys think this is a good thing for the box logo to drop online? Personally, I think it's not the best idea, but I'll go over why I don't think that's such a good thing like as the video goes on. But right now I just want to ask like, what are your opinions on it? Because yeah, it's like a very... Like, I feel like it's a very good topic to talk about because everyone has different opinions on it. It's very controversial because people rather have Supreme be more like limited, but also a lot of people rather have it be more accessible. So let me know what do you guys think. So just like the Brooklyn box logo, it seems like it's going to be a trend that every time Supreme does a store opening box logo, they're also going to drop it online and then give the proceeds to charity, which is a good thing. But it's also a bad thing if you want like the exclusivity of Supreme to stay really high. I feel like some people are probably really surprised that it dropped if you guys weren't aware of the Brooklyn box logo dropping way back in, what is that, FW17 maybe, I think that's when it dropped. And probably it dropped to the expectations of a lot of people, including myself, I did think it was gonna drop. So I was kind of like prepared for it, but I also kind of wasn't because I was kind of expecting it not to drop because I didn't want it to drop personally. So as for the drop itself, I took a big ass out because of a card decline, the old enemy. I escaped it for this season so far, but it's back and it fucked me up. Pretty much the whole issue was that today is very cold. It's like the first really cold day in Las Vegas. So I had a really hard time getting out of bed because you know, when it's cold, you don't want to get out of bed. So I ended up getting out of bed a bit later than I should have. So I was kind of running a bit late. So I usually plan to get to school if I want to do a Supreme Cop. I usually get there just before like just before 8 so that I can get myself like settled and everything and get the cop and then go to the 8.30 class. But today I actually was in the car when the drop happened. Luckily I was at a red light, like perfect timing, got to the red light right at around. So I was, you know, copying and driving low key but not really because I wasn't moving. So I got in two checkout attempts, both checkout attempts ended up in a car decline. And then obviously it turned green, so I had to go. So that was pretty much the whole story for me. But please don't cop and drive. Probably not the smartest thing to do, but I was at a red light. So I mean, I don't know. Maybe I would have copped if I had my computer set up. Well, you know, with my laptop right here, maybe I would have gotten a W. I really don't know. I'm not going to like beat myself up over it too much just because like in a few years, it's not really going to matter to me. Honestly, it's not that big of a deal. Life goes on. If you guys are like really sad over taking an L on this or you guys didn't know it dropped and you guys took an even bigger L, like it's not that big of a deal, you know? It's a nice shirt to have or it's a nice few hundred bucks that you can get, but like in a few years, if you guys get a job or anything, it's not gonna be that big of a deal. If you guys have a job, then a few hundred bucks is probably not like huge, huge deal to you anyways. But if you guys did cook that up, like that is a Congrats pretty much because I felt like a lot of people did get caught decline based on what I was reading around like the Supreme Reddit Look at like the the post about the drop a lot of people did say they took a car decline, which is like crazy Some people are saying this is the first time they got caught decline, but the item did sit for a while I think it sat for a few minutes So I mean some people like you know took multiple attempts and got in so it makes me kind of sad that I wasn't able to get multiple attempts in and then also partially could be the reason that I got the client was because I was using a cell phone, so I don't know, it really sucks, but oh, it's, it's whatever, you know. So that is all for my opinions on the drop. Let me know like what do you guys think of the drop down in the comments down below. Like I said at the beginning of the video, super interested to see like what does everyone have to say because I'm not a fan of these dropping online. I think they should be kept really limited because it just makes the brand more special. You know, it takes away from how special the box logo t-shirts are because box logo tees are really, really exclusive. Like they don't do normal drops of them. It has to be a collab or a store opening. So I think that, or anniversary. So I think that they should be kept really limited and really special. And I think it kind of sells out the people waiting in line at the store or people in that city when they finally get the drop and then it's not exclusive, you know? So that's all for this video. So you guys did enjoy my opinions and this whole video about the drop. Please drop me a like down below. Appreciate everything like you guys dropped me. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. And thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.